It's your boy Revolutionary because I am your favorite freedom fighter. It's favorite freedom fighter thugging it everywhere. Don't believe me? Ask that bitch nigga about me. You dig? All right. I guess a uh, sad week again for Syrians. Um, recently, there was an airstrike that killed over 200 people. Now, whenever I hear this number, I always time it times three. So if they say 200, I'm really estimating like 600 people. And it, it, was, it was fucked up because I heard a report on CNN saying they're going to try to talk to... Um, I think it was NATO to have Russia put like a, a 30 day ceasefire. Now, this war has been going on in Syria for a long time, way before it even hit the mainstream media, way before Americans even decided to take interest in this because people was, were, were way concerned way before it even hit the television. Now, I thought about two, three years ago, they said it was Hassad that was using chemical warfare on the people. Then we found out it was not the Syrian government. So from there, once I found out that the, the, the United States media and the American government lied about it being the, the Syrian government using chemical weapons on the people, and then now they're saying that they're going to ask Russia to do a ceasefire as if it's Russia, the one causing these airstrikes and killing these innocent people. So, once again, the story is never believable when it's coming from our side of the country, our media, our government. So, like, this airstrike... It's just, it's just out of control. Now, they're worried about gun control here in America. How about we have drone control? How about we have airstrike control? Like that, we're killing not only hundreds, but thousands of people overseas. And we're worried about the little small mass shootings that, that occur, here in, occur here in the States. Like, do, do the people not see the madness and the bullshit here? Like, why are we worried about the wrong thing when you're worried about one, two people killing somebody here in the States when we're killing thousands of innocent people overseas? Uh, is it me? Am I, am I the only person that's concerned about this? Because this is not uh, on mainstream television. Where meanwhile, in, in Sunrise, Florida, the hood, they're having a town hall meeting about gun control in Florida. Now, Trump, uh, and I, I, I got to agree with Trump. This may be his best idea yet. He is agreeing to allow some teachers to carry guns in schools. Well, I think that's, there's nothing wrong with that because we police everything from our celebrities our politicians get police and protection, our sports stadiums, our banks, museums, all these type of events, there's this armed security, but our schools are the only one, only one area that, that's gun free. Makes no sense. Now, I feel like if there's more guns around, there'll be less people to, to think they're going to be able to act a fool and go on these mass shooting sprees. It's always in an area where there's limited guns. Think about it. But hey, I'm not going to go talk your motherfucking head off. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment. Follow me on Instagram, Revolutionary Cuz. Like the Facebook fan page, The Revolutionary Cuz Show. Until next time, smoke one for your boy. Triples.